Why I drink green tea, and you should too. It's an outstanding habit, and I'd really like for you to have it in your toolbox of holistic lifestyle techniques to use for your self care. So rock on to green tea because it's loaded with a ton of antioxidants. And I'm not talking about traditional Japanese matcha tea that you need to whip and froth and do all that kind of business. Although that's great and it's good for another video later on.、Um, by the way, matcha and green tea both come from the same plant. It's just that what we see with the green tea, it either comes loose, the leaves, or it's in bags. And matcha tea. Has been made into fine powder. Okay, so lovely people, it will be great if you will stay tuned because I'm going to talk about the benefits, and then later on I'm going to also talk about some additional benefits about、uh, green tea. But for now, green tea contains polyphenols that are antioxidants, meaning it protects the body cells against oxidative stress. And there's also some more positive benefits in that chemical kind of thing.、So、it contains a type of plant compound called catechin, and research suggests that catechins may play a role in protecting your cells from damage and preventing disease. Hi everybody, it's Shirley Mearson here, and I'm glad that you stopped by today. And please partake of so many fabulous educational videos I have on this channel. But let's get back to one of my lovely things that I enjoy in life. If you stay with me, you'll know it's tea and flowers and a whole bunch of other fabulous things that really help with the mind-body connection. Okay, back to the research about what is green tea doing. Okay, it supports brain function. It may reduce inflammation, and inflammation is the cause, as we know, of many chronic diseases. Green tea can aid in digestion, reduce the risk of developing heart disease, offer some protection against cancer. And they say that green tea may promote weight loss. So my suggestion to you, of course, is to make green tea a drinking it a ritual. I mean, everybody can enjoy drinking green tea. It becomes like a relaxation technique. Make it a really, really ritual. Excuse me. It's a beautiful holistic lifestyle habit to have. You can do it as an afternoon break. And you know, in the spirit of keeping life simple, you could use tea bags. I mean, it just depends on what the story is in your life. If you're home and you have a fancy gizmo to make tea,、um, there are so many beautiful ones, traditional ones with glass and how it works, and put the leaves in. It's fabulous. But if you're running around and it just, or you want convenience, get a tea bag. It's fine. And all over the world, because I have shopped in a lot of other stores, they do have organic green tea in bags. Please do it. I'm saying, make sure it's organic. It's a great addition to your pantry and to your life. Okay, let's move on to the how to do it. You're going to say, "What the heck is with you, Shirley? How to boil a cup of tea?" Well, I've seen some goofy stuff. Boil your water, people. Don't do what I see folks doing. They're microwaving water. It'll make me nuts. <laughs> and come on, my goodness, you can buy an inexpensive and small, convenient electric tea kettle. They don't cost much, and you can get them. And it's some of them even have dual electrical things. So I've taken them up and back different places. They're so easy now. And so what you do is you put your organic green tea bag. It's waiting in your cup, or your tea leaves that are in the infuser. And people let it steep for plenty of time. I mean, if you look on the box, it might say one to three minutes or three to five minutes. It's okay if you do it up to ten minutes. I do it all the time. Sometimes I've left it in longer. 
I mean, what you're going to need to do is keep your tea covered to keep it hot. Uh, there's nothing going to be wrong about keeping it in longer. And the flavor is light, but yet it's it's distinct. So get yourself into it. Get your taste buds used to it. It's quite nice. I really urge you to take a break from life and have a tea break. And we haven't talked about caffeine, but the content of green tea is going to depend on the preparation. So for an average 8-ounce cup, it's going to have about 29 grams of caffeine. And coffee provides more than three times the amount of caffeine than green tea. Okay? So that's why I said it's okay to do it in the late afternoon. And as I've discussed with clients and I've discussed on this channel, you don't want to be drinking coffee with the high caffeine contents after two in the afternoon because you want to have your sleep cycle okay. All right, let's move on to those additional 10 more benefits of green tea. And I'm going to mention a couple of them, but if you'd like to just stop the video and, and, and stare at them because they're quite, quite amazing. Like green tea helps your bones. It boosts immunity. And bingo, ding, 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 it lowers stress. Oh my God, how wonderful is that? I mean, I'm not being funny. I'm being sincere. So there you have it. I would love to be a tea sommelier one day. I've thought about it, but I'm going to get into it and talk about black tea and some other teas. But there is another, uh, some other videos on the playlist for tea, so it's great. Now, if you'd like to make an appointment to fine-tune your lifestyle habits, I have some single sessions still available, but naturally, we can make more progress with a package of sessions. And send a request, people, to the email mentioned on the screen, which is shirleymearson.com forward slash contact. Also, I'd love to see you over on Patreon. You could become one of my patrons where I offer four membership levels to choose from. It's like having your own wellness coach in the house. And over there, I can give out plenty of freebies and, you know, things that I can't do everything here. On YouTube, it's just not as convenient. I do inspirations. I give out uh, do-it-yourself mini courses. There's a lot going on there. And actually, the top tier level called Bamboo includes one coaching session per month. So I do encourage you to check it out. And I thank you so much for being here today. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Hit that bell so you know when I post again. And if you have any comments or things you'd like for me to talk about in the holistic health world, just let me know in the comments below. See you soon in the next video. I send my wellness wishes always.